on-target bypassing with Target Link and the RTI Bypass Block Set. Real-World Bypass Demonstration. This video will show the following information. Control Desk Overview, Demonstration with Deactivated Bypass, Demonstration with Activated Bypass. This Control Desk project visualizes how the new bypass controller works. The graph shows the controller's input variables and the brake light value calculated by the controller. The gauge displays the brake pedal position with the I indicating the emergency brake threshold. Additionally, two lamps represent the state of the brake and turn signals. The DSpace on target bypass technology allows you to adjust calibration parameters during runtime. This is the demonstrator that runs the actual ECU application. The slider is used to simulate the car's brake pedal. The bypass controller is currently disabled to demonstrate its original behavior. If the brake pedal is pushed above the emergency brake threshold very quickly, the original controller turns on the brake lights and flashes the turn signals three times. Now you are going to enable the bypass controller. As you can see, in case of emergency braking, the bypass controller makes the brake lights and turn signals flash alternatingly.